Hi, I'm Sam Patrick, the Health Queen, and what I'm going to explain today is what a female hormone balance is really all about. Now, hormones are little things that run around in our body, and what they do is take a message from one gland to another part of the body, or another gland. So it might be adrenaline to race up to the heart and say, beat quicker. With regards to our sex hormones, there's quite a few of them, but the, one that, uh, the, ones, the three primary ones that um, throw us out of balance are estrogen, progesterone and testosterone. Now a really good balance of these hormones, and that's what we ideally should be aiming for, consists of the following. So, ideally we're looking for under 10 estrogen, optimally between 3 and 6, so let's just say 4. And for each one of these estrogens, you should have about 200 progesterone. So in a very healthy, fertile, happy woman, you'll find that she'll have a ratio of 1 to 200 of these guys. So there's four in there, so I'm just about to put 800 in. Bring it out. So that's a healthy estrogen progesterone balance. For most people, that's going to make them feel a lot better and happier than um, they currently do if they're not in that ratio that mix. Now the third main hormone that um, affects our wellness and uh, our fertility and how we feel is testosterone. Now testosterone, when you check it via saliva, which is the only way to check these hormones by the way, should be roughly between 80 and 100. So let's put a few of those into the mix. And there you have this beautiful mix of hormones. And when you find that in a lady, she's a very happy, content, functional lady who doesn't feel stressed, who isn't over committing, who has a normal libido, and falls pregnant very easy. So that's a normal female balance.